Wait a minute, that isn't electrical stuff. Of course not. We're gonna be talking about and showing you examples of good electrical work and not so good electrical work. Some violations and maybe where they a little more than wanted to be correct. But we'll come back up here and see. All right, staple there, staples over there. That's good. That's not good, an open splice. And then we come back here and we'll come over to here. You can see it's some bad twisting. Come along, one, bring this all the way. And it's just kind of, that's so good. And you can see again, it's just, it's not so bad there. It's not so bad, but could be better. We're coming in here. We've got three wires coming. There's two twos, a three wire. There's a three wire. And there's, so there's quite a lot of energy going in and out of this box, it appears. <clears throat> right, two circuits is feeding something. It's the kitchen above it. But I can tell you right now that the kitchen and the outlets and the everything is just really bad. And we got this here. Look at this sucker. There's not a support. One there and one down there. And nothing under this pipe here. Just horrible. But we're doing electrical. And let's see, we've got another conglomerate. Just tight, pull, doesn't matter, don't care. And this one, we have again, a few extra wires going in there. It's <clears throat> probably overfilled. And then we've got, oh, this is my favorite, one of my favorite things here. Yes, this is, uh, I wonder what other circuits are coming out of that. <clears throat> Because, uh, one, two, three, four, this is the air conditioner. Look at this. Just whoopie-doo, whoopie-doo. And it comes down along here. And there you go, right there. Just, and then, yeah, mine set's horrible. But what was this other box that had? Oh yeah. Wonder how many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <clears throat> Gee, going to a bathroom. Look at that stuff. That's just horrible. And yeah, this is nothing. Tight band going into here. That's gonna deteriorate that insulation eventually if that's hot water. <clears throat> And just willy-nilly, don't really care what they say. And then, oh, you should have seen this thing. There was a hole in this side, size of a plum, easily. Little extra oopy doos there. But there's just, oh, it's just so bad. But I do know that there's one circuit that feeds the furnace, the water heater, the washer, the dryer, the bathroom over here, the jacuzzi that's in there, an outlet in the bathroom, bedroom upstairs, an outlet in the bedroom on the other side, and a bathroom upstairs as well. So, <clears throat> and let's see if we can, let's say it's just horrible. You should see the line set going out there. It's just tremendous. And you can see, oops, oh, whoa, blackout. What's going on? Oh, no. Yeah, that looks like no problems, does it? Look at that. I like seeing the new wire because it's all that yellow and you can tell in the panel I even want to go in there. But the good work and the bad work, you can see it there. Most of the good work is the older wiring, which tells me that who did this work was not qualified. Look at all the twists in this wire right here. It's twists. And it pulls and uh, I just 
Horrible, horrible, horrible. And this little jewel, oh, this is the back side of a test that I did for my drywall hole plugging system. I don't know what you want to call it, but uh, I'm do like a three inch hole. Oh, here's another box. And that's got one, two, three, four, only five into it. And you know this is coming in, this is feeding it. From, coming back and then branching out all, it's just really not good. Anyway, hope you can see the differences and understand that good work is not necessarily that much harder to do. You just have to care so you don't do things like this and swirly lose and oh my goodness, horrible, horrible, horrible.